when participants view your shop and select the products they would like um, to buy, you may want to display some sort of description um, of the product. This video is going to show you how you can set this up. So if you go back to the shop settings, in the products tab, you can see in the spreadsheet, I've uploaded a column named description. In this column, I have listed all the descriptions that I would like to be displayed for each product. So if you go to the content uh, tab, you can set the condition up here. You can choose to add the content blocks and you have the choice of either an image or an HTML. As I would like to draw the information from the spreadsheet, I'll select HTML and use this HTML string to display the information. Notice that this part of the curly brackets is the name of the column that I would like to draw the information from in the spreadsheet. So that says description and that matches description here. Um, you can also choose whether you'd like it to overwrite or append any other existing content. And then you can choose where you'd like to display this content. I would like it to be displayed underneath the button on the product page. But for example, if you have labels set up, you can display it next to the labels or any of these other options. Just quickly, if you do decide to use an image here, this image will need to be uploaded to your assets tab first. So let's preview this and see what it looks like. So just select it from my content conditions and press start. So now when I click on the products, you can see the description is displayed underneath the button. And that is how you would go about setting up some product descriptions for your shop.